Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Neil Narn. We're once again in Enshrouded. So last episode we, we had a, some fun. We covered uh, my body here that got lost in the fog. Figured out how to get through that from this buried tomb area. We did get that completed out. We also had a big battle with the troll up in uh, one of these locations. This guy, the Hills, Hills of Scavengers, I believe is where that was at or we didn't do that when we did the one that was over here the vulcan ceremony hill but we do have a quest to come up here to the hill of scavengers and we had kind of went past that but didn't go into it i want to go into it and see what we can see so i do have my little base here for teleporting uh, i have an empty inventory sack all my weapons are fixed up and ready to go let's go see what we can see over there i have a feeling it's going to be another one of the big bosses but hopefully we can see it in the daytime a little bit better and i'm going to try to get there in time to do that so let's fast travel there and we're going to look at the hills so this is the catacombs i do want to do the catacombs but uh, i want to do that a little bit after we get a little bit more skill in us because we're this area is a little bit higher level than we're ready for not too bad i mean it just makes it a challenge let me get some berries here that way i have something to help recharge and heal me i did go through health potions like crazy i probably should have picked some more up or got the uh alchemist to help me make some more I will plan to do that, but we'll, we'll, we'll do our best with what we have. So let's go uh, punish these uh, people and see why they're doing something they're not supposed to be doing. That being said, I do want to get a little bit more health going on me. Not a lot, but every little bit helps. There is a cave there. We'll, we'll come back and check that cave out. But we're going to go up into this camp here and see what we see. There's some flint out here if we need more flint. So I'm going to try to draw him out. I was standing too close to that, that's for sure. Get my health back up. I wasn't paying attention and shot it. That's one way to do it. Let me get some scrap metal here. I didn't get uh, anybody uh, angbunctious to come out and say hi. I don't know what's up here. That's why I'm being cautious. It looks like you just, oh, there, see, there's a big guy up there. I knew there was going to be one. I don't want to get him aggroed on me yet. Yeah, come on down here. Not too bad. These are level 7 or level 5 or 6 now. If I actually look at uh, my character sheet, uh, we're level 7, so we're right on level for this now. So we'll, we'll do fine. I have faith in this. Take care of you. I will take this guy out. Stun him there. That works out pretty good. Let's see, there's still a guy back there. We'll see if there's anything else here. We'll loot this guy up. See if we can see anybody else roaming the low, lower camp area before I go up. Yeah, we got a big guy up there. I see him walking around. I'm I'm not ready to face him yet. Some of those guys have poison attacks. Some have other attacks. So 
We might have to throw a few bombs his way, see if that does any good. Oh, well, why can't I? There we go, just had to open it up a little bit so we can search it. Anything in here? Some more books, but I'm going to hold off on the books. Ah, sent the dogs after me, huh? Anything else in the kennel here? Looks like that's all was in the kennel. Oh, there's a guy up here. I gotta get up to him. Okay, we took him out. Watched out for the traps. None up on that one. Nothing over there. Okay. Yeah, scavenger gouge ma gouger matron, which we need that for. I think that's what we need for the uh, upgrade to the base. So we're definitely going to do our best here. Let's finish clearing out below here. Teach you how to do this. Got another berry in me just to heal up before the battle. See if there's anything good around here. There's something over here, so we'll search this. A reed. Ah, oh, the rumors are true. Dark Lavender encampment fusing mass amounts of elixir straight into the hearts. Oh, that's not good. They spit poison, so we got to watch out for poison. I don't have any poison defense on me. I probably should have grabbed some, but we'll do our best. I'm going to wait to go up. I want to... Trying to get that uh, attack sometimes. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Throw stuff at me. How rude. Crazy, crazy. Okay. Get up here. There's somebody around here. Where I oh, don't see him. Is he over there? Oh, he's coming down. Okay. Okay. Let's throw another gem my way or fruit. I need to find a, a repair before I go attack. See if there's anything in one of these to do repair. Finish looting around the bottoms. Be nice if they have something to repair, but they're all kinds of loot. Gotta watch out for traps like that one. Got too close to it before I disarmed it. That could be deadly, that's for sure. There's a place to repair. There we go, now we'll be ready for battle. Okay, let's see what we can do with the Gorgon up here. Hopefully, I missed this chest while I was going through here. Had a lockpick on me, that's good. Another stamina ring. I got plenty of those. What is that? Mysterious flask? 
Uh, let's see, what's what's in the mysterious flask? That's not it. That's got to be what the mysterious flask is. Just increase your shroud time. That's not mysterious. Okay, let's let's go uh, say our highs to Gorgon. Hopefully, Gorgon's all alone. I do see. Oh, dang. Okay, don't do that. Do not uh, go right up. Okay, I won't do that again. Okay, we're not that far away. Whoa. Well, it doesn't help to uh, fall right off the edge and not roll. I thought I hit my roll button, but it didn't work. Nothing, nothing to pick up because it doesn't take it on the second death. Don't know if you lose EXP or not. That'll be interesting. I don't know what other penalties there are for death. Try to get some more berries while we're going this way. And I'm going to try to come up the back way here. Get our stamina back up. Berries are about out. And we're going to do more arrows. I think arrows was doing it. If I stay behind the walls, I can dodge stuff. Gorgon sealed back up, so. Dang, that's rough. That breath attack, and I gotta see how to trigger to know it's a breath attack coming. Cause that is rough. I'll try that again, and I'll. <laughs> the bombs weren't doing too effective. The arrows seem to do the best. I'll try this again. I know we can take her, it's just a matter of watching out for her breath. Give her a tic-tac or something. Still does not help against it either. That's just shroud. I don't have any other defense for her. No, I don't. Dodge check.
pretty good right here. I think we're going to get her this time. Oh, don't do that. Take it so easy, one step at a time. Is this teasing it a little bit? Yes, but with that attack, you almost have to. We're going to take her out, though. Got to stay back a certain distance, so... Yes. Oh, that was nasty. Got shepherd lightning rod, huh? Or staff. Let me... Let me look at that backpack. The range grip and epic. Ooh, I might uh, I might be switching to a new one. That's both of these are epics. That's by default's 20 power. This is 20 power with all the enhancements. So we're gonna have to upgrade that and see what it does. A new bow. That's an epic category. Look at that bad boy. It's 11 power before all the enhancements. We'll have to upgrade that and see what happens. Okay. We did it. We we beat the boss. It wasn't pretty. I will admit that. But it doesn't have to be pretty if you win. I hope you enjoyed that little battle. At least you got to see the whole thing. Okay, let's uh, go back to base here. We got some uh, weapons to look out. I might have to do some deconstructing of other weapons that I'm not using just to get enough runes together. That's what I have. No runes in there. They're all in here. And I got 95. Yeah, I definitely need more runes. So, this guy we determined we're not using. I got two masterful maces. This is level 30. This is level 42. I'm going to keep this masterful mace. That's good. Uh, short stored. It's only level 11. Our 11 damage is level 1. We're going to get rid of that bad boy. Tainted axe. I... I kind of like this axe. It's a heavier duty axe. Don't get me wrong. Um, though this one's cutting, cutting, and blunt. This one has piercing on it, but it is slow. At the end of the day, I can get more wax with this one because it is one-handed versus two-handed. So we'll salvage this one. I uh, can't salvage rings, unfortunately, so we'll just hang on to those. This Forester Longbow, um, it's definitely weaker, so we're going to salvage that. Or delete that, because we don't need it. Might as well save the space. Anything in here we can get rid of. This is another Forester Longbow. It's rear. It's not epic, but it's only 17 power, so I think we're going to salvage it. Of course, the sword will salvage. Shepherd staff. It's low. I, I've I've had a few different staffs. I'll wait and get a good staff. Okay, so we're gonna come over here. Craft equipment enhancements. 
So what's this guy go up to once I enhance it? 26, that's a lot better. This is actually not better than my hunter's bow at 19. Uh, 19, 1% draw speed, 250 durably, 200 draw. Yeah, it's not as good. So, come back over here. This one here, we will go ahead and salvage. The wand we're going to swap out, but we're going to keep this one in case we decide we like it better. This one has better power, though, so I don't think we will. Put this away. Put some stuff away here that we don't need. I still need to build all the new chests and everything, but this is the start. So, that Gorgon head, I believe that's the one we needed. Yes, we needed that for this. So we can actually upgrade our altar. Hmm. 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 I think I have everything. Let's. Whoop. Can I pin all this? Be nice if you could pin this. So wax, salt, spark. See what I have. I have plenty of wax. We'll go ahead and put uh, some stuff away here as we're going through this. I don't need this anymore because I do run the big torch. Uh, wax, do I have any salt in here? Salt, salt. No salt in there. Do I have any salt in here? D bug dust, guts. Got plenty of bone meal. I don't want to make any bone meal for a while. So I think I need the sparks. I have seven salt here. I might have to see if I can get more salt. And see what I need. Got plenty of wax. I need three more salt. I need three more sparks. Shroud wood, flint stone, and charcoal. Shroud wood is here. Charcoal I have in the other. Definitely need to get some organization. I'd have some charcoal here too. We'll put this away for now. Any more salt? I'm just double checking I didn't put salt somewhere else. Like I said, I'm going to do some reorganization in the base over in, after a while. Uh, any salt left in here? No. How about, do I have any salt in here? I know I used quite a bit. I have one salt. I need, still need two more salt, so I may have to go to the salt mine, which that's always fun. I still need also flintstone and sparks. Do I have any more sparks anywhere? So I'm going to have to go around and get sparks too. Looks like. Make sure I didn't put any over here. No. Okay, so we got to get some salt and some sparks. So let's put some stuff away. I want to keep all this separate. Put animal fur in there and regular fur in there for now. And here we'll put the ring. And we'll put uh, this here. Oh, I do. I have crowd cores. I do have sparks. I got plenty of sparks. So I don't need sparks. I just need more salt. That's a little easier. We can do that. Top off my berries. We'll put these away here. Uh, I don't need to cook the meat. I'm going to put it in here for now. I'll come back to get it. And 
So we're getting there. I do need to see if I have any more health potions. So we're going to put everything I need for upgrades in here just so I can find them real quick. Just like so. Let's see, do I have any more health potions in here? No, I do not. Did I put any down here? No, but I got more explosive balls. I'm definitely going to do some major organization and changes here soon. I want to make a lot of medium chests, or I would love to make some more magical ones first, though. Okay, let's see. What do I need to make healing potions? Purple, red mushrooms, and water. Well, that shouldn't be too hard. Should have red mushrooms over here. Also, I have plenty of those. Red mushrooms, and I got plenty of water already on me. Piece of cake, then. There we go, that's five. That gives me six total. That should hold me over. Let's go ahead and put this stuff away. And now we know how to make potions. We're going to go ahead and sleep until morning, get some resting, and then we're going to go get some salt. I want to do a base upgrade here this evening. Okay, we, we got that. Okay. Map. Now the salt is right here and there's a career nest there too i do i can get to this tower here i was saying what is i'll have to go check that out at some point so i guess going here first and then flying over this way and around is probably going to be the best method Uh, before I go, I didn't bring any with me, but I should. This one gives... Damage multiplier. Damage multiplier. Where's my, uh, flask for, uh, surviving? There it is. Shroud survival. We'll take one of those with us. Okay, let's let's go. Let's let's get over and get some more salt. And let's go ahead and set a waypoint. Off in that direction. And I'm going to go a little bit different before I get there. There's a, a mushroom or a safe zone that we can open up over there so we can go back and forth easier. Yeah, got you. No problem. Let's go up this way. There's a tower over there. 
I think over there is a resting area. It's a nice little chest here. Let's see if there's a way up anywhere. I don't see any way up that way. Go back down here. So I know this is a salt mine. I think there's. Oh, got too close to that one. snuck up on me. I wasn't expecting you there. Save that timer here. I think there's a... A thing I can clear out up here. I want to check that. Maybe not. I thought I saw one over here. I know how I can look. I don't know why I'm not doing this. Map. Doesn't appear to be. I thought there might have been one here. So, bag. Let's see this guy. That'll give me more time and then I'll come back down here. And grab this guy. I'll restock my time for up here. And let's open up chests and stuff while we're going through this. Let's go in here and we'll look for more salt. There's some salt. If I like that wand, get some more salt here. There we go. Just kind of looking around while I got a few seconds. Hmm. 
Not seeing a whole lot, so we're going to go back out. I got some more salt. That's all I really needed. We'll come out and really clear this another time. There's a bunch of salt right there. Lots of salt here. Let's see, I got a little time here. We'll now, supposedly you can dig yourself into a hole and get out of the crowd. And I've never been able to do it, so I'm going to go ahead and head back out. Oh, I stunned him. Like that. That time I did. Some theories and stuff we'll read on later. Let's get out of here. I know there's one over this way. We'll have more than enough time to get to it. So we'll run this way. Of course, everything will be respawned over here, but that's okay. We can take care of it. here make sure I don't are on my HUD so I don't go the wrong way but yeah we should be able to make it I know I did it before last time but we'll see Yeah, it's right up here, so we should be good. That's all we had to do is get here. And we should be able to teleport right back over to here. Oh, nope, we can't fast travel. Not quite clear enough. Do I have to go downstairs and re-clear it down here? Uh-oh. Let me out of there. Yep, I gotta re-clear this guy. No problem. Search and get all this good stuff while we're here. the one that's uh, attacked me there. Get this cleaned out.
One more shot. Come on, we can do this. Knock it out. There we go. Oh, there you are. Take you out real quick. Still one around here somewhere there he is. Okay, that should be everybody. Now I should be able to teleport home. Get out of here. I forget those things reset, so you have to come back periodically, but we're back home safe. And we should have everything we need to now upgrade our base again, and I want to do that. So we'll grab all this, see what we need left. I think we might need a little charcoal, maybe. Flintstone, we need flintstone. Let's see, do I have any flintstone in here? Do I need to go get some more? I have very little foot stone, unless I have some hidden somewhere else. Nope, so we do need to get flint stone. Get rid of that. Shift tab everything else into there. Empty things out. I need to put this away. Come up here, put that away. This is a slow attack, I will say that. It's a ranged weapon, so it's not a staff, but just slow. Either that or I had this guy, the scorching wand, which we'll hang on to it for a little bit and check it out. We should be good on everything else. So let's go get some flint. We know right where some flint's at. So we'll go over here and grab some. So we saw a whole ton of it sitting over here. Hello bunnies. Hey, you better run. Mean old guy is coming by. Let's hit up here. And I remember seeing a whole bunch of it around one of these corners. Oh, it's in out front, that's right. There it is. It's like I know it was around here somewhere. Okay, there we go. Map back. And we're ready to upgrade our base. Oh, you buggers. I was almost out of there and you had to interrupt me. I 
Okay, let's grab all the stuff. And let's do this. Need that. Could have kept that on me. Need that, 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 and that. That should be everything. Let's see. Strengthen our flame. Oh, I forgot to grab flintstone. I only have five on me. I thought I picked up more than that while I was out. Oh, now we have enough. I'm going to have to definitely, whenever I see flintstone, just go do some mining of it. Okay, we have everything. Let's strengthen the flame. Our flame is now level three. And what that does for us, I gave us six in an altar capacity. Uh, level three shroud passage level, which means we can go longer. Uh, or in bigger areas of shroud. And might be able, we might be able to go all the way to the one area that we died in the previous episode. Uh, we can now spend seven minutes in the shroud. That's kind of nice. And character attribute bonuses are two now. So that's good. So now if I look at... I can now have six of these. That's awesome. And my skills, attribute levels, uh, character attribute... It supposedly updated some of this. Oh, I'm susceptible 100% by poison. I'll have to fix that at some point. Blessing Flame boosts your primary attributes by two. So all these got boosted by two. That's kind of cool. Okay. Well, there we go. We've, we've done a thing. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a like button. If you're new to the channel, give me a subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one.